supporting. We thank God for you that are here. Praise God. We thank God, amen, for allowing us this privilege and this opportunity once again to, amen, to come together. And so at this time, uh, if uh, Sister Parthenia, if you don't mind, could you give us an opening selection? And this will be in the hands of Brother Brian Appowitz for the prayer and scripture. And, and then in the hands of, amen, praise God, Brother Adrian uh, Smith and uh, in our prayer, request and prayer, amen, praise God. Um, and then we'll be in the hands of our speaker of the evening. Um, let's make sure he is. Amen. Praise God. Looking to see if he's here yet, but uh, Elder Brackett, amen, will be our speaker this evening. Amen in Jesus' name. Praise God. Sister Parthenia. Saints, don't stop praying, for the Lord is not. Saints, don't stop praying, he'll hear your cry. The Lord has promised that will he do. Saints, don't stop praying, he'll answer you. Saints, don't stop praying, for the Lord is not. Don't stop praying, he will hear your cry. The Lord has promised, his word is true. Saints, don't stop praying, he'll answer you. Oh, don't stop praying, for the Lord is not. Don't stop praying, he'll hear your cry. The Lord has promised, his word is true. Saints, don't stop praying, he'll answer you. Oh, don't stop praying, the Lord is not. Don't stop praying, he will hear your cry. The Lord has promised that will he do. Don't stop praying, he'll answer you. Thank you. Yes, Lord Jesus. Oh, glory, glory, glory. Hallelujah. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, Heavenly Father, God, Jesus, my Lord and my God. We thank you for once again for allowing us, Lord, to come into your presence, oh, Father, God, Jesus, my Lord. I pray, oh, Father, God, Jesus, that all that we present unto you is acceptable in thy sight, oh, Father, God, Jesus. We have made it, my Lord and my God, unto another week, oh, Father, God, Jesus, another Friday night with you, oh, Lord, God, Jesus. Hallelujah, Lord. And we are just grateful, my Lord and my God, Jesus, to just be in your presence. Hallelujah, Jesus. I pray. My Lord and my God, Jesus, that you guide the tongue of the individual speaking on tonight, oh, Father God, Jesus. My Lord and my God, like I said, I just pray that our, our testimonies, our praise, our song, everything, hallelujah, Jesus, is all to the glory of you, oh, Father God, Jesus. Just continue to watch over our family, oh, Father God, Jesus, and us as well, Lord God, Jesus. I pray for the whole body of Christ that's scattered throughout the world, oh, Father God, Jesus, that is doing your work and your will, oh, God. We just thank you and we praise you. In Jesus' precious name, we pray. Amen. Um, I'm going to be reading um, this uh, three verses uh, in the book of Psalms, uh, the first book, uh, one through three, the book of Psalms, first book, uh, verses one through three. They say, Blessed is the man that walketh not in the counsel of the ungodly, nor standeth in the way of sinners, nor sitteth in the seat of the scornful. But his delight is in the law of the Lord, and in his law doth he meditate day and night. And he shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water that bringeth forth his fruit in his season. The person talking low. His leaf. Sorry about that. His leaf also shall not wither, and whatsoever he doeth shall prosper. May the Lord add a blessing to his word. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Mm -hmm. Praise the Lord, everyone. But we do thank God for another Friday night service. Giving honor to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, to Mr. Roach, to our team, Mr. David, Mr. James, uh, Mother Roach, and the bracket, all the deacons and mothers, um, to my family, to my children. We truly thank God for another Friday night. We thank God for just another opportunity to give God some praise, 
Mm-hmm. Want to have a wonderful time on tonight. Definitely don't want Sister Ali calling us out. So we, mm-hmm. I said, everybody get their uh, get their testimonies, get their songs. And let's have a good time in Jesus' name. I'm going to start with a song and then someone, someone can start us off with their testimony or a song. One, 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 one way to God. There's only one, one, one. One way to God, there's only one, one, one way to God, baptized in Jesus' name. There's only one, 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 one way to God, there's only one, one, one. One way to God, there's only one, one, one. One way to God, baptized in Jesus' name. One way to God, there's there's only one, 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 one way to God. There's only one, 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 one way to God. There's only one, 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 one way to God. Baptize in Jesus' name. Thank God there's one, 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 one way to God. There's only one, one, one. One way to God, there's only one, one, one. One way to God, baptized in Jesus' name. Thank God there's one, one, one. One way to God, there's only one, one, one. One way to God, there's only one, one, one. One way to God, baptized in Jesus' name. Amen. Who'll be the first to start us off? I will praise thee, O Lord, with my whole heart. I will go forth all thy marvelous works. I will be glad and rejoice in thee. I will sing praise to thy name, O thou most high. When my enemies are turned, when my enemies are turned back, they shall fall and perish at thy presence. For thou hast maintained my right and my cause. Thou sattest in the throne, judging right. Thou hast rebuked the heathen. Thou hast destroyed the wicked. Thou hast put out their name forever and ever. O thy enemy, destructions are come to a perpetual end, and thou hast destroyed cities. Their memorial is perished with them. But the Lord shall endure forever. He hath prepared his throne for judgment. Thank the Lord for the reading of his word. In Jesus' name. The Lord saved me and I'm glad. The Lord saved me and I'm glad. He sanctified me holy, filled with the Holy Ghost. The Lord saved me and I'm glad. The Lord saved me and I'm glad. The Lord saved me and I'm glad. He sanctified me holy, filled with the Holy Ghost. The Lord saved me and I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad. The Lord saved me and I'm glad. Praise the Lord, saints. I'm glad. Hallelujah. I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. Pray my strength in Jesus Christ. Lord, I just want to thank you. 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 And I want to thank you. Oh, Jesus, oh, good 
No, not one. No night so dark, but his love can cheer us. No, not one. No, not one. Jesus knows all about our struggles. He will guide till the day is done. There's not a friend like the lowly Jesus. No, not one. No, not one. Jesus knows all about our struggles. He will guide till the day is done. There's not a friend like the lowly Jesus. No, not one. 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 Praise the Lord, saints. Oh, give thanks to the Lord for he's good and his mercy and just forever. I thank the Lord for that song. Because can't nobody do you like Jesus. No, not one. No, not one. Giving honor to my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, and to everyone on the Zoom that hear the sound of my voice. I give God the glory because he's worthy to be praised. There's Amen. not a friend like the lonely Jesus. You can search the whole wide world. You can't find nobody can do you like Jesus. Hallelujah. And I think, and I praise God. I want to thank the saints that was praying for my aunt and my uncle. My uncle passed away uh, yesterday evening around about seven o'clock I was told and I, I I thank each and one of you that prayed because he was in stage four cancer he had been at, he had had cancer oh, since 1985 and God had blessed him you know he I think he was about 86 87 years old so God blessed him a long time you know I, I remember him witnessing to my husband how he had cancer and how he pulled through it and you know and then he was diabetic and at, at two and and his diabetes had took control of him in his last days when he came out of remission with his cancer. The diabetes just took control of his body. But I think and I praise God because God is worthy to be praised. Actually, I'll continue to pray for my aunt. She's going through radiation uh, with, her, with her cancer and stuff and everything. So God is still blessing. And I thank God for her just being alive. You know, uh, my aunt is about, is, in my family, my grandmother had 13 children. And she's the only girl that's left. And I got an uncle that's with her now, her brother. And he's the only two that's left out of 13 children. And I think and I praise God. Hallelujah. I think and I hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank and I praise God for being so good to me. I think and I praise God for the Mother Day celebration that we had last Sunday at our church. You know, you know, mothers are very important. And I think and I praise God. I was telling the saints how. I was brought up and now you know some things you'll never forget you will never forget what you've been taught and i how my mother brought us we had she had six girls and how she was to send us out in the neighborhood and we would have to take care of people in the neighborhood when the when the wife gets sick or uh, she was uh the neighbor they would call me oh sis, send one of your girls and see like i was picked on all the time going out in the neighborhood taking care of family you're know, raising children and and combing the hair and, and cleaning and washing, just like we were like little, little, little housewives or something. And that's been with me all my life. I've been doing that since I was a little girl. And, and you know, some things when you've been taught and you know, it's hard for that to leave you because it's on the inside of you. Nobody don't have to make you do anything. Nobody don't have to tell you. It's, it's you, you know, and I think and I praise God how I was taught by my mother. She didn't have the Holy Ghost. But one thing she yes, said sir. when I when my husband got saved, I'll never forget it. She and her, she and my father had came to Connecticut, and my husband had got saved, and he was going to his church, you know, the Holiness Church, and I was going still going to the Baptist Church. And my mother said to me, she said, "Cherry, she said, where are you taking me?" I said, "I'm going to my church." She said, "But well, where is George?" I said, "Well, he he went to his church," and and my mother looked at me, and I'm driving, and she said. No, baby. She said, where your husband go, that's where you need to be. She said, you need to be with your husband. She said, do you know that you're going to one church and your husband going to another? She know, she said, did you know that could break up your marriage? 
something can come in between your marriage. She said, you need to be with your husband. My mother didn't have the Holy, hallelujah. My mother didn't have the Holy Ghost, but I believe God guided her lips to talk to me and let me know I need to get, get saved. Thank you. I needed the Holy Ghost just like my husband. And I, when my mother said that to me, I didn't say not one word back. Because as a child, we was taught, you don't talk back to your parents. So mm -hmm. I listened to my mom. And so when they went back home to Alabama, that thing bothered me. And my husband had got saved uh, December 26, 1984. And I got saved the third Sunday, 1985 in January. Because that thing bothered me because I realized that I was not equal with my husband. He had the Holy Ghost and I didn't have it. And I think and I praise God. God let me know I needed just what my husband had. You know, and that thing bothered me. And that thing bothered me. Yeah. And, uh, and I, I thank God for the Holy Ghost yet behind in my soul. Because like the scripture said that the sanctified husband will sanctify the wife. Somehow I'm not saying that. I might not be saying it exactly, you know. But that, that's, that's a true statement. If you live right before your spouse, you will, hallelujah, you will encourage them to get saved. And somehow I just knew that I was not equal with my husband. Yet I was still going to the Baptist church, but I knew I was not equal with him. And I Thank wanted you. what he had. I made up in my mind, I said, Lord, I said, I don't care what it takes, but I give me the Holy Ghost. I and I meant that thing. And I went to church that Sunday morning and seemed like the pastor was preaching on nobody but me. Hallelujah. <laughs> See, like, I thought my husband had told him everything about me, but he hadn't said nothing to the pastor. It was the Lord talking to me. And so I went to church that Sunday night and I made up in my mind. I looked up in my living room door where I was living and I said, Lord, don't let me come back home in these doors tonight I without the Holy Ghost. And I, I meant that thing. So I went back to church that Sunday night and I went in this room, they had like a receiving room, a prayer room, you know, where people just sit and just pray with you. If you want the Holy Ghost, they just sit and pray with you. So when I went in that room, I looked up in that door. I said, oh, Lord, don't let me come out this room tonight. I didn't care what it takes. I said, don't let me come out this room tonight without the Holy Ghost. And I missed that thing. It was all in my spirit. I didn't want to go back home without, I didn't care if it took all night. I said, Lord, fill me with the Holy Ghost. And when I sit down in that, on that couch and I, and I close my eyes, you know the devil's always with you. I don't care how much you talk to the Lord, the devil hear everything you say. Cause mm -hmm. he heard me when I said, Lord, don't let me go right. home tonight without the Holy Ghost. And I meant mm -hmm. that thing. Mm -hmm. And when I closed my eyes, I closed my eyes and I was focused on nobody but Jesus cause I had blocked everybody out. Everybody, everything. I didn't care what my mother thought. I didn't care what my father thought. My, my sibling, my friends, and I had some close friends in Connecticut, but I, I blocked them out. And I closed my eyes. When I closed my eyes, these lights came up in front of me. Red, yeah. green, yellow. All these lights came in front of me. And the name of this club was Main and Tau in Hartford. I had never been in that, in that, in that uh, club. I was not a party person. I wasn't raised like that. That's and when right. I met my husband, yes, he went out, he did this, that, but I did not do that because I was brought up that way. I stayed at home. And when I saw that main town club, I rebuked it. When I rebuked that, I started, hallelujah. And I started speaking in hallelujah, hallelujah. And that night, they had a hard time trying to get me out of that church, out of that room. Every time I would go to that room, I stayed in that room so long, speaking in tongues. I, I mean, I was just going, oh. And I said, Lord, I, I, I kept saying, Lord, I thank you, thank you. Because yeah. I heard myself speaking. Yeah. I knew yeah. I was speaking in tongues. Yeah. I knew it because it just seemed like I was on the cloud nine. That's where I oh. felt. Like I was floating <laughs> on cloud nine. I, I knew the Lord know. had delivered me. And they could not get me out that room. Service had started. And, and they said, Sister Billy, Sister Billy, we got to go upstairs now because service done start. You know, they sing the service done start. And so when they brought me up, they finally got me out of that room because I couldn't stop thinking the Lord enough. When I yeah. finally got out of that room, I went upstairs and they sat me beside my husband. And my husband said he didn't know if I had the Holy Ghost or not because he said, I was just crying, 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 you know. And then I saw a hole in my mouth. He said, well, look, look like she. So anyway, when the church was turning out, the pastor got up 
He said, anybody got something to say to the night? He said, daughter, he said, he said, daughter, you were down in the room. You got something to say? And when I stood up, I just started speaking and talk. I, and my husband said, everybody said, just tow up the church. Everybody start running. So many people told me that, that night and the week after, they got a refreshing in the Holy Ghost. They said, when I start speaking in tongues, they got a refreshing. They got a refreshing. And so many people told me, said, we know you got it because I got it. They got it all over again. That was a refreshing to them. But you know, I thank God. And there's not a friend like the lonely. Anything right. you want, I'm a true witness. You want the Holy Ghost, God will fill you yeah. with the Holy Ghost. Yeah. But you got to want it bad enough. You got to be determined. That's what you want. That's what yeah. God want to do for you. Yeah. Fill you with the Holy Ghost. You thank ask you. it and you believe it. You trust him. He will fill anybody with the Holy Ghost. Amen. I'm a living witness. I didn't mean to take up this time. I didn't mean to go this uh, way. But you know, I thank God for the salvation. I, I thank him. My aunt and my uncle, they don't have the Holy Ghost. They, you know, they not filled with the Holy Ghost, you know. And my husband and I, we don't talk to them many times, many times. But you know, it's up to them. It's up to her now. He, I mean, he got to go, he got to, you know, give an account, you know. But I thank God for saving me. As y'all continue to pray for me, pray for me hard because I'm having a, a, a really rough time with this month with my husband's birthday, May 2nd. And I went to the cemetery today and, and I, I just, I, I, I lost, I just start crying, you know, because I, I, I miss my husband's saints. I'm telling y'all, I miss him. I miss him at nighttime. During the daytime, I'm fine. But at nighttime, that's when it come down on me. Be four years coming up this month, this October, October 17th, be four years. As y'all continue, pray for me, pray for Sister Cherry Billy, because, you know, it's not hard living by yourself. It's not hard. It, it's not easy. It's, it's, it's not easy. I'm telling you, it's not easy. But I know and through it all, God will, will, will yeah. come for me because he, he, he is my father. Now, he is my mother. He is my husband. He, he is my comfort. Yeah. He's everything to me. And I Thank trust you. God. Yeah. I, I trust God. Yeah. I lay down at night and I, I close my eyes and sometimes I wake up and sometimes I don't. Sometimes I sleep right through the night. But sometimes when it bothers me, uh, I, I lay and, and I say, Lord, you know, comfort me. And God will comfort me when I to, when I ask him to comfort me. That's what he does. He yeah. comforts me. You know, Thank the, Bible you, say you have, the Bible says you have not because you ask not. And I ask God sometimes, I say, Lord, comfort me tonight. Yeah, yeah. Comfort me tonight. And I think, and I praise God that we have a friend like Jesus. There's not a, hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, pray, Jesus. Pray, pray for me, pray for me as Amen. I pray for you all in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you. Let's give it a hand for that great God testimony. It feels so good when you hear somebody just praising about how you feel when you got the Holy Ghost. You know, I thank God for being here another week. The Lord has kept me. And last night I was on um, YouTube just listening to all the gospel songs. You know, sometimes I just do that. Willie Jack, uh, Willie Lee Williams. I don't know if y'all remember him. Oh, uh, yeah. uh, cool, cooling water. I mean, I was going for it all. Uh, but I just want to thank God. He's been good. And yeah. I got to turn the light on because I'm all speaking now and I'm trying to. But I, I thought about uh, Elder Quentin when I was listening. And I said, I was just singing. You couldn't tell me that I wasn't in the gospel choir. And I know how Elder Quinton always say, look, y'all, y'all know I can't sing, but I'm going to sing my song. So I just want to thank God. But I, I, I'm i glad I saw Sister Lisa Coleman is on here. And I was thinking, maybe if I say it, you know, maybe one Sunday when she at church and sing, she'll sing this song. Because I can't sing it, but I'm going to sing just a little bit of it. I can only imagine what would life be. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Just to see by your glory what my heart will feel. Will I dance for you, Jesus? Or oh, in all will be still when I sing hallelujah. Will I be able to speak at all? I can only imagine. Uh, I can only imagine. 
I just had to say that. Maybe Sister Lisa will sing that for us one day. God bless y'all. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Down at the cross where my Savior died. Down where for cleansing from sin I cried. There to my heart was the blood of pride. Glory to his name. I am so wondrously safe from my sin. Jesus so sweetly abides within. There Jesus took me and took me in glory to his name oh glory to his name precious name glory to his name there to my heart was the blood applied glory to his name oh i'm singing glory to his name precious name glory to his name there to my heart was the blood applied glory to his name praise the lord everybody praise the lord everybody surely god is good and he is wonderful and he gets all the glory all glory goes to his name yeah. i give an honor to god who is the head of my life hallelujah and the source of my strength hallelujah I give an honor to Bishop Roach and to Mother Roach. Um, I give an honor to Elder Gillespie and Sister Gillespie, Elder Quentin and uh, Sister James and uh, all the ministers, Minister Pugh and, and to Minister Carr in his absence. And I just truly thank God for just being God and God alone. Uh, thank God for watching over us and covering us. Um, I thank God for protecting us from hurt, harm, and danger, those both seen and unseen. I right, thank yeah. God for, you know, uh, even in the midnight hour, right now our street, our security door is uh, unable to be locked because if we lock it, we'll lock ourselves in. And um, something's going on with the lock where it's broken. I thank God that even through the night, he keeps us and he covers us and he protects oh, us and he watches over us. Hallelujah. And he allows no hurt nor danger come nigh our dwelling. And I surely give God yeah, a praise. Yeah. Hallelujah. Because it's only him that does the keeping. It's only him that does the protecting. It's only him that does the saving. Hallelujah. Surely the Lord is good. Thank Great you. and mighty is he. Hallelujah. I, I, yeah. I'm just so overjoyed in my spirit. Hallelujah. I'm just so happy. And I'm just, you know, I've just been spending time with the Lord. Hallelujah. And, and I've been just getting my joy and my strength back. And my, you know, I, I love to encourage myself in the Lord. Hallelujah. That's and it's right. been really working and just lifting my spirits. Hallelujah. And bringing me out of that little cloud that I was sitting under. And I truly, truly give honor and glory to his name. Hallelujah. For he is Thank good God. and he does all things well. Hallelujah. I sit back and I reflect on uh, even my relationship with my with my siblings. Hallelujah. And how last year, uh, coming up around this time last year, mm. Uh, I got into a real big argument with my sisters, hallelujah, and um, the, the ultimate problem was just that I'm safe, and um, so because of that, my lifestyle, it changed, and it doesn't match theirs anymore, and so because of that, they, they don't, 
They don't want to deal with me. They told me they My just Lord. tolerate me, you know, and I thank God because, you know, when, you know, the Bible says when the enemy comes in like a flood, God will Lord. lift up a standard against yeah. them. And I thank God because sometimes your family can be your enemies. Hallelujah. I thank God that sometimes, you know, your enemy can be yourself. And I thank God that this time around when they tried it again, I thank God that he covered me and he lifted that standard. Last time I found myself in a place where I almost couldn't come out, you know, and I found myself, uh, I found myself, uh, ready to just throw in the towel and just say, forget everything, forget everybody. I don't want, just leave me alone. I was so hurt. I was devastated. And this time around when they tried to mess with me, I just thank God, you know, I was able to lift my hands. I said what I had to say and all was well on my end. I didn't need to apologize for what I said. Amen. And hallelujah, I was able to say what I said in a holy manner. Hallelujah. And I thank God that I was able to walk away unbruised. Hallelujah. And I thank God that I was able to continue to keep my head up and press toward the mark, hallelujah, of the prize of the higher calling, which is in Christ Jesus. And I thank God, hallelujah, because he's brought me a mighty, mighty, mighty long way. He's grooming me and he's pruning me and he's tuning me and he's purging me. Hallelujah. He's arranging and rearranging me and my attitude. Hallelujah. And I just see it every day. Hallelujah. All the works of his hands. Hallelujah. How he's so wonderful and the way he does things is just thank so excellent. You. Hallelujah. Wonderful. And I just truly give glory and honor to God. Hallelujah. This week, I've all week long, I've just been spending time with the Lord. I guess, you know, it's a song that says I'm saved all day. You know, I've been saved all day. Hallelujah. And I just thank God. Hallelujah. For his keeping power. Hallelujah. Amen. How he just continues to keep my mind stayed on him. Therefore, I'm remaining in perfect peace. I choose, hallelujah, to live this life that I'm living. I could go another way. Hallelujah. But I thank God that I choose. Amen. Hallelujah. I choose Christ. Hallelujah. I choose the way of holiness. Hallelujah. And I give glory to God for that. Those of you who know the words of prayer, please continue to pray much. Hallelujah. For my husband as he journeys on home tonight. Hallelujah. That the Lord will give him in the group yeah. uh, traveling grace and mercy. Hallelujah. That there will be no accident nor injuries. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. And um, continue to pray for uh, my children in Jesus' name. Please continue to keep my mother in your prayers. And please continue to pray for my father yes, in Jesus' name. And also my siblings and my family in Jesus' name. God bless. Amen. Praise the Lord. Do we have any others before we cut off? I am determined to hold out to the end. Jesus is with me, and him I can depend. I know I have salvation, feel it in my soul. I am determined to hold out to the end. Praise the Lord, saints. To give honor to God, who's first in my life, to my pastor, Bishop Roach. Praise God, and to our assistant pastor to all of the, to the saints of God, to my lovely wife, Sister James. I thank God for his goodness and tender kindness. I thank God for his mercy and his many blessings. I thank God for his grace and kindness, because truly the Lord is good. I thank God for this heart he had blessed me and my family, how he had keeping us even in the times we're living in, because it had not been for the Lord. None of us would be here. Truly, I decide to say to God and know the word of prayer. You continue to pray my strength in the Lord. It is good to see everybody. God bless you in Jesus' name. What a mighty God we serve. Amen. What a mighty God we serve. Lord, I just thank you. I thank you. I thank you. I just give him all the praise, the honor, and the glory. I'm asking y'all know the words of prayer to keep me and my family in your prayers. What a mighty God we serve. Praise the Lord, saints. Amen. Truly like to give our Lord. 
Savior Jesus Christ. I just praise him and thank him truly for my health and my strength. Truly, I just praise him and thank him for God being good to me. He had blessed me to see another birthday, uh, first, of the, first of this month. And truly, hallelujah, God really been good to me, hallelujah. As I thought about my husband, our anniversary was on the 8th of this month. And uh, it really bothers me uh, quite a bit, hallelujah. And truly, because my birthday, my anniversary, and Mother's Day, they're right behind each other, hallelujah. But I just praise the Lord for if he would have been living, we could have been married 52 years. But I just thank God for these years that he was with me. God has blessed me in so many ways. I thank the Lord for the saints that give me my birthday a gathering, hallelujah, on, on, on the first of the month, hallelujah. I was really surprised. The Lord had blessed me to see all of my children together over Sister Billy house. I didn't know what was going on. Mm -hmm. And my daughter, she flew from Arizona, come home to be with us. And my son, and uh, he lived in South Carolina and one in Virginia, hallelujah. And Brad Jess was supposed to be on the road. But through it all, God bless that everybody was home, hallelujah. And I just praise the Lord, hallelujah, how you oh. bless me. 20 years old now, hallelujah. I say no longer young, hallelujah, but I thank God for my health and strength. I thank God, hallelujah, for he blessed my mother, hallelujah. You know, she's still with me, hallelujah. And I just praise him and thank him. I thank the Lord, hallelujah. I've been able to see Sister Missy and Sister Shirley, hallelujah, on that week, hallelujah. I just praise the Lord. God been good to me. He's been a merciful God, hallelujah. And he gave me a mind to continue hold on to him, hallelujah. Sometimes it's rough and tough, hallelujah. But I thank the Lord, hallelujah, for that. Like Sister Billy, hallelujah, say hallelujah. We get together, hallelujah. We all, all of us are a widow, hallelujah. Sister Billy, Sister Lisa, hallelujah. All of us, you know. But God is good through it all. God give us a mind to hold on to him and continue praying, uh, passion praying. Hallelujah, that the Lord, you know, continue give me strength and hold on to him. Hallelujah. And I just thank him because my, uh, he's been gone for about 11, 11 years. He's coming November the 18th. But God give me strength to hold on to him. Hallelujah. And I don't want to look back. Hallelujah. I want to look up to him. Hallelujah. And hold on. Hallelujah. To the Lord. Hallelujah. And continue fast and pray. Hallelujah. That the Lord be able to keep me. Hallelujah. Thank and you, Lord. Never he called me, hallelujah. So you all pray for me, pray for my children. And I thank for all that support me on my birthday, hallelujah. I love you all. You all show the love, hallelujah. That, you know, I don't expect all of those going to be, but God that blessed, hallelujah. And I thank the Lord for all of you, hallelujah. You all pray much for me, pray much strength in the Lord. And Bishop Ross, I praise the Lord for you and our pastor. We had a good pastor, hallelujah. I thank the Lord for him, hallelujah. He always there for us, hallelujah. And I just praise him and thank him for that. Your prayer much for me and my children. God knows the plans. Yes, Lord. For me, he knows the thoughts. He thinks towards me. And nothing is an accident. I'm alive because there's more. I'm alive because there's more. God knows the plans he has for me. He knows the thoughts he thinks towards me. And nothing is an accident. I'm alive because there's more. I'm alive because there's more. Saints, I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm alive. And this is not an accident. I'm alive because there's more. I'm alive because there's more. I'm alive 
I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm alive. And this is not an accident. I'm alive because there's more. I'm alive because there's more. Praise the Lord, saints. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord to God who's the head of my life. To, our, to my wife, my pastor, sister, pastor, everyone in the household of faith, thanking and praising God just for that small, that little song that I that I heard um, by watching um, one of the um, progressive holiness churches um, oh, yeah. service. And that song just really, it really is a part of my testimony. Um, on Mother's Day was my spiritual birthday. And um, that song just been ringing in my soul since that um on last Sunday, because, you know, many of you know that um, I could have been dead a long time ago. Um, I, mm -hmm. I just recall the testimonies of um, with me and my cousin on um, Mar Coral, Coral Hill um, that the, had a gun pulled out on us over for my um, North Face jacket. I recall um, walking wow. through with my spin gun, um, just um, about to get robbed for some shoes. I, it's just so many times that the Lord has spared my life. And back then I wasn't even saved. So that, that song is really a part of my testimony now because I thank God for filling me with the precious gift of the Holy Ghost on May 9th, 2007. And I nice, don't take yeah. it for granted. And, I, and that song, just it just speaks my testimony. It is not an accident that I am saved on today. He thank spared you. my life. He saved me right in the nick of time. And I just wanted to give God the praise for that continue to pray for me and my family in jesus name amen praise the lord everyone <clears throat> we truly thank god for all the <clears throat> wonderful testimonies that went up on on tonight I, I just want to give special recognition to our mothers mother smith mother taylor mother billy mother ollie y'all doing a wonderful job on zoom Y'all always have your camera on. Y'all always give God some praise. Thank you for setting the example. Um, y'all doing a great job. So I just want to just want to take us a moment out and just recognize y'all. Y'all, let's give these four mothers a hand. Amen. With, with all with all the challenges of modern technology, y'all y'all doing a wonderful job. <laughs> just uh, end on a, a short song, and then we're gonna put in the hands of Elder David Gillespie, and then we're in the hands of um. Elder Brackett, just a little bit of the song. He's a wonderful savior to me, so wonderful. He's a wonderful savior to me, so wonderful. I was lost in sin, but Jesus took me in. He's a wonderful savior to me. Yes, he's a wonderful savior to me. So wonderful. He's a wonderful savior to me. So wonderful. I was lost in sin, but Jesus took me in. He's a wonderful savior to me. Yes, he's a wonderful savior to me. So wonderful. He's a wonderful savior to me. So wonderful. I was lost in sin, but Jesus took me in. He's a wonderful savior to me. Amen. The hands of Elder David Gillespie. Man, praise the Lord, everyone. God bless you all. Thank the Lord for allowing us to come together again on this Friday night. Uh, the Lord uh, continues to be uh, very kind uh, and merciful to all of us. Thank the Lord for the wonderful testimonies and the songs of praise that have gone up um, for the Lord. Um, uh, and it's 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 our our it's our privilege uh, to be able to do such a thing as to give yeah. God. Praise, glory, and and honor. We thank God for the opportunity, again, uh, for all that's been said and done. We, we thank the Lord for each and every one of you. We honor Jesus. Uh, we thank the Lord for our leadership, our uh, our pastor and our elders and ministers and all the mothers and all the saints of God, everyone that is here tonight. I uh, thank the Lord for my family, my wife uh, and children. Uh, we certainly thank God for his goodness unto us, uh, even during these times. And God is still in control, believe it or not. God is still uh, in control of all things. And we bless him um, for uh, all that he's taking us through and helping us to learn 
um, about both about the way of holiness and and about him and about ourselves. Praise Amen. the Lord. Thank Amen. God for, for his goodness in doing that for us um, because he is good. We want to give uh, everyone an opportunity, those that desire to give uh, a prayer request tonight. If there is uh, someone on your heart, whether it be a family member, uh, could be yourself or a family member or perhaps a neighbor or a co-worker or someone that uh, you are aware of uh, that is in need of prayer. We'll give you an opportunity to let the saints know uh, tonight uh, who that is and what their situation is. And so we can take them before the Lord uh, as we go in prayer uh, briefly tonight. So let me pause for a moment and see if there are any uh, prayer requests. Praise the Lord, everyone. I'd like to ask a prayer for uh, a neighbor of mine. His name is Fred Majors. Um, he's dealing with some um, serious issues. So I'd ask that you keep him in prayer. Okay. Praise mm -hmm. the Lord, saints. Um, we uh, ask you to pray for Pearl Herring. Um, she was in a car accident where her car flipped like two times over and she came out, it appears, without a scratch. I mean, she was blessed, but she did um, crack her sternum in her chest and her um, a portion in her arm is broken. Uh, she's in a lot of pain, um, but she's still rejoicing that she's alive. Pray, pray for her, her name is Pearl Herring. And I do ask you to pray for me, the Lord. I, I In my testimony, I didn't say it, but the Lord is good. I had had this pinched uh, feeling in my uh, back, but the Lord, with laying hands on myself and praying, the Lord did touch it, but I can still feel it's there. So I need your prayers and continue to pray for my household, my husband, Lewis, and we just thank the Lord for you all. Praise the Lord, Saint. Please, please pray for Brother Charles Thomas, my father, who has surgery on today. In Jesus' name. Amen. Are there any others? All right. And also, if there are uh, any uh, praise reports about those that have uh, we've request that have been prayer has been requested before, um, and there is a development or a, a a change in situation, if you can. Certainly let us know uh, whether the Lord had delivered or if things have gotten better or worse or however uh, the case may be, uh, we certainly would be interested in knowing uh, an updated status for them. Um, I will go through the chat area and pull out the ones that have requested prayer there, but if there are any others, uh, you can make it known at this time. Uh, I visited uh, Elder Thomas Williams um, yesterday and he's doing good. He's outside getting some vitamin D and, uh, and Mother William, they outside enjoying they, they little sunshine out there. And he's doing good. He's exercising every day. The doctor want him to get up every hour and do some walking. So he, he's doing that. So he's looking good right now. So continue to pray for him and his, his wife, Mother uh, Juanita William. Amen. Praise the Lord. Good to hear. Any others? All right. Let me quickly read. Uh, in the chat area, there's a couple uh, prayer requests listed. Uh, Sister Parthenia, uh, I'm sorry, uh, some, uh, someone asked for prayer for Deacon Troy Malcolm uh, and his children, um, so we want to remember them. Um, also, Sister Weaver is asking for prayer for herself uh, as well and family. Uh, let's remember them in Jesus' name. Um, quickly just going down to see if there are any others. Um, and also that she receives the Holy Ghost, Sister Weaver again, and thank the Lord for that request. And I also thank the Lord for, I did get a report from Sister Vonner, uh, her, uh, this is Sister Lisa's uh, grandfather. Um, she mentioned that he, he did have a uh, surgery uh, today and he's recovering in ICU. Uh, they were able to, uh, his heart was weakened, but they were able to remove and open up a number of blockages. Uh, so she's reporting that he is, uh, things are better. So we thank the Lord for the prayers that have been offered on his behalf. And we want to continue to pray that uh, God completes the work uh, and blesses him um, to recover fully uh, and uh, that uh, he will come uh, to know the Lord. I was teasing Sister Varner 
that uh, now we worked on the body. Now let's let's work on his soul. And she she just laughs. So, and that's important. Uh, we pray for people that they be delivered. But uh, it's one thing for the body to be delivered from ailments, um, but it's more important that the soul be delivered uh, from uh, destruction. So we want to uh, keep them in prayer in Jesus' name. Are there any others before uh, we go to God? Yes, Elder David. Um, I'm requesting prayer for one of my um, friends from dialysis. Um, she had a kidney transplant uh, two weeks ago. And she texted me on uh, Mother's Day to say that she had a fever of 102.3. And they told her to come back. So um, she's in the hospital now. And uh, just pray that, I just pray that her kidney is not rejecting. Her new kidney is not rejecting. Um, so keep her in prayer. Phyllis Franklin. Phyllis Franklin. <laughs> yes. Please right. pray for, um, I'm sorry, Sister Talita, um, the young lady that um, comes, with, comes to the church sometimes. Her father, he's 92 years old, and he fell. And um, he went to the hospital, and they had to uh, do um, heart surgery on him. Um, I believe it was taking place today, but continue to pray for him and also her in Jesus' name. All right. Praise the Lord, David. Yes, sir. I uh, want to add um, um, the um, received some really horrific news from uh, Jamaica yesterday. Um, uh, I you had mentioned my brother Ch uh, Deacon Choi uh, Malcolm, and this is the husband of uh, some of you all know uh, Sister Joe Joy Sand. Uh, from Jamaica, uh, the church in Green Island. And there was a horrific accident on, I believe Sunday or Monday, but I believe it was Sunday. Uh, and uh, I received a call uh, from uh, the pastor, Elder uh, Dixon on uh, yesterday morning that she did not survive it. And uh, I ask that you all keep um, uh, the husband, uh, Deacon Troy Brown. Also, there were three, I think, in the car. It was her nine-month-old uh, baby uh, who's in the hospital, and also uh, Brother Fromm. Uh, he is the uh, youth president in Green Island. And so those two are still in the hospital. And uh, again, uh, ask that you all continue to keep them in prayer. Um, I think they were married. Uh, about six, seven years, uh, two, two young children. And um, again, uh, ask that you all just remember them, the family, the church family, amen in Jesus' name. Uh, amen, praise the Lord. All right, um, are there any others? Quite a bit, um, praise the Lord, that has been mentioned. Um, Again, we, we thank the Lord for these requests, and we will certainly uh, we can take them before the Lord, both tonight and in prayer uh, that will ensue after this and in subsequent meetings as well. If you bow your heads for a moment, Lord, as we go before Jesus. Lord, we are grateful, Lord, for this time. Thank you for your goodness and your mercy, Lord, and your kindness in allowing us to come together, Lord God, for this service, Lord, the purpose of worshiping you, Lord God, even over this venue. Lord God, and even during this time, Lord, you're still worthy of praise. You're still worthy, worthy uh, to be glorified. You're still worthy to be talked about, Lord, because of the things that you have done, Lord. You are doing marvelous things in the lives, Lord God, of so many, Lord. And we're grateful for the opportunity just to share a little bit of that, Lord God, amongst each other. Grateful, Lord God, for the songs that were sung before thee. We pray to you, accept them, Lord, in the same spirit as given, Lord God, and even the testimonies, oh Lord God, telling of your goodness and your mercy, Lord. We're so grateful and grateful, Lord, for all that you have done for us, Lord. We're so, Lord God, bless, Lord Jesus, to, to have you, Lord God, as our God, and, and knowing you, Lord, personally, Lord. We're grateful for that opportunity, Lord Jesus. We're praying, Lord God, even for these that have been mentioned tonight, Lord God, we're praying that you would remember them, Lord God. Remember Fred Majors and Pearl Herring, Lord God. Remember Tom, Charles Thomas and Phyllis Franklin, Lord, 
remember the tears father, Lord Jesus. Remember the family of Sister Joyce Ann, her husband, Lord God, Deacon Brown. Remember the saints there in the church, Lord God, in Jamaica, Lord God, even as they mourn the loss, Lord God, of this dear sister, Lord, and bless those that were in the accident as well, Lord God, to recover, Lord God, speedily, oh Lord. We know you're able to bless, Lord God. You're already there, Lord. You've been there. You were there when things happened, Lord, and your eyes are upon all things, Lord God. And we're praying that mercy would be extended to them, Lord, and that you would bless them through this ordeal, Lord Jesus. We're praying, Lord God, for all of those that were mentioned, Lord God, both tonight and before, Lord God, concerning prayer, Lord, that have asked, Lord God, for for your mercy to be extended upon them, Lord. And we're asking, Lord God, that you would do just that according to your will. Lord Jesus, we know you know what you're doing, Lord. We know you are good, Lord. We know you are merciful and kind, Lord God. Hallelujah. We charge nothing to thee, O Lord. Hallelujah. Because we know, Lord God, hallelujah, you are sovereign. And you do, Lord God, as is fit, Lord Jesus. And we are grateful, Lord God, just to have the opportunity to call upon you, Lord, and to let you know the things that are weighing on our hearts, Lord God, concerning our loved ones and our neighbors and our friends and all of those that we are aware of, Lord God. We pray your blessings upon them. We pray a blessing upon each and every one tonight that is on this call, Lord God. We pray a blessing, Lord God, upon our families, oh Lord God that they may come to know you first of all and be blessed of you, O Lord. We're praying also, Lord, that you would bless the word of God that will be shared with us tonight, Lord. I Elder Brackett, bless him from the crown of his head to the sole of his feet, Lord God. Bless his wife, Lord God, and his children, Lord God. Remember them, O Lord God. Remember the saints here, Lord God, all of those that are on this call, Lord. We're praying that you would bless us all as only you can. Thank you for your goodness and thank you for your mercy. Help us, O Lord, to come to know you as we are to, Lord. We pray your blessings upon us tonight. For we ask it all in Jesus' name. We pray. We say amen to thee. Amen, Lord. Thank the Lord for the prayer uh, tonight. We continue to pray for those uh, that have been mentioned uh, and pray for one another in Jesus' name. At this time, we'll be in the hands of Elder Rupert Brackett, who will be our speaker for tonight to encourage us through the word of God. Elder Brackett. Praise the Lord, everyone. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, everyone. Praise the Lord. Bless you. Praise the Lord, Pastor. Praise the Lord. 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 God is good. Yes. And he is worthy. Thank you, Lord. Of the praise. Truly, I want to give honor unto our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, to our overseer, Bishop Roach, Elder David Gillespie and to all the Elder, Elder James, to all, Elder, all the elders, each and every one. I greet you in the wonderful name of Jesus Christ, who is our Lord and our God. We thank God for this opportunity to come before you in this moment just to speak a word unto you from the Lord. Our Lord, he is God. It is he that has made us and not we ourselves. So we thank God for that. But I don't know how long I'm gonna be with you but I'm just want to read from the book of St. John chapter 14. And I'm gonna read from verse one. And it said, let not your heart be troubled. He believe in God, believe also in me. In my father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you. I go to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you unto myself. That where I am, there you may be also. And whether I go, ye know, and the way ye know. 
Thomas said unto him, Lord, we know not whither thou goest, and how can we know the way? Jesus said unto him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. If ye have known me, ye should have known my Father also. And from henceforth ye know him and have seen him. Philip said unto him, Lord, show us the Father, and it suffices us. Jesus said unto him, have I been so long time with you? And yet have thou not known me, Philip? He that had seen me had seen the Father. And how sayest thou, show us the Father? Believe me that I believe thou not that I am in the Father and the Father in me. The word I speak unto you, I speak not of myself, but the Father that dwelleth in me, he doeth the work. Believe me that I am in the Father and the Father in me, or else believe me for the very work's sake. Hallelujah. And if we, if I turn to the book of Isaiah, chapter six, chapter nine and verse six, and it reads, for unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given, and the governor, the government shall be upon his shoulder, and his name shall be called Wonderful Counselor, the Mighty God, the Everlasting Father, and the Prince of Peace. Praise the Lord. Truly, we have seen the word that have been spoken of by the prophet. We have seen the word that have been spoken by Jesus himself. He said, let not your heart be troubled. If you believe in God, believe also in me. And if you understand what Jesus is saying, he said, I am God. If you believe in God, I am the one that you got to believe in. Hallelujah to God. All the manifestation and the power of the Almighty God we could see all in Jesus Christ. How he magnified himself to his disciples. How he magnified himself to the people. But they couldn't understand. But I heard he said unto Thomas. Thomas asked a question. Lord. Thomas said unto him, Lord, we know not where the dog goes, and how can we know the way? Jesus turned to Thomas and said, Thomas, I am the way. Not only the way, but I am the truth. And I'm also the life. Otherwise, in me, you can find, Thomas, the way, the truth, and the life. 
Hallelujah. Jesus said unto him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. If ye had known me, ye should have known my Father also. From henceforth ye know him and have seen him. Otherwise, what he's saying to Thomas, Thomas, you, you have seen the Father, you have known him. And by that, Philip said, Lord, Philip said unto him, Lord, show us the Father. If we understand the question good, Philip was not saying, show me thyself. But he asks to be shown the Father that it might satisfy us. He want to be sure of whom the Father is. Jesus said unto him, have I been so long time with you? Look at the, what Jesus is giving. Jesus is pointing to himself. Have I been so long time with you? And yet have thou not known me, Philip? He that have seen me have seen the Father. And how sayest thou, show us the Father? Believe me, Philip. Thou, believe thou not that I am in the Father, and the Father is in me. The word I speak, I don't speak of myself, but the Father that dwelleth in me, he doeth the word. Otherwise, when you're looking at me, you can't see what's going on. But the Father that is in me, he's working. He doing the work. I speak. When he command me to speak, I work when he command me to work. Hallelujah. I myself, I don't do anything. But the Father that dwelleth in me, he doeth the work. Hallelujah to God. Isaiah pick it up and said, unto us, a child is born. Unto us, a son is given. And his name shall be called Wonderful Counselor, the Mighty God, the Everlasting Father, and the Prince of Peace. Hallelujah. God has manifested himself unto us in the person of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. And have made known unto us the power of the Almighty God who said, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one. Hallelujah. Thou shalt love the Lord with all thine heart and with all thy soul and with all thy strength. Hallelujah. God want all. Hallelujah. He wants us to love us with our whole heart in the mighty name of Jesus. We cry out unto God with our whole heart. We seek him with our whole heart because he's God from creation. Hallelujah. But he manifests himself in flesh 
hallelujah, for our redemption. And we are looking to him who knoweth all things. And truly, we cry out to the Lord. Timothy pick it up in 1 Timothy 3 and 16 and said, For without controversy, great is the mystery of godliness. God was manifest in the flesh. Hallelujah. Preach unto the Gentile. Believe and was in the world. Receive up to glory. And we know who it was. Hallelujah. There is not another saving name, but the name of Jesus Christ. For the Bible said the name of Jesus, every knee shall bow and every tongue confess of things in heaven and things in the earth and things underneath the earth, knowing that God is our deliverer. He is our healer. He is our strength. He is also our refuge. He is the rock of our salvation. We thank God even for the power and the gift of the Holy Ghost that was manifest through us. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. For great is our God. And he is greatly to be praised. Truly we look unto him. Knowing all things. Are possible. If we only. Believe. He said. In John 3, 16, for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. If we want everlasting life, we got to believe it. Just like Jesus said, hallelujah. We got to believe that we have it in Christ Jesus. Hallelujah. Because he promised that we shall have everlasting life. We have came to the place where we have repented of our sins. We have been baptized in water in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of our sin. We have been filled with the power and the gift of the Holy Ghost, speaking with other tongues as the Spirit of God gave utterance. Hallelujah. Believe in. Hallelujah. That we have got eternal life through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Hear us, for God is able to deliver Hallelujah. I was saying a few days ago that the devil is mad with the people of God. He's mad with God. And he, but he can't do God anything. So he's mad with the people of God. And he's trying on every hand to see how he can stop them, to see how he can slow them them down to see if he can destroy them but by the grace of God we shall overcome we shall stand we shall worship and honor the Lord for the Lord our God is great and greatly yes. to be praised in the mighty name of Jesus God is true hallelujah and he's coming back for his people. The Bible said, he said, I'm going, hallelujah, a way to prepare a place for you. And if I go, I will come again. I was just saying, then if the place was prepared for us, then the Jesus would not say, I am going to prepare a place for you. 
Hallelujah. Because if I go, I'll come again. Hallelujah. But God is great and greatly to be praised. Saints of God, let us keep on fighting. The good fight of faith. Let us lay hold on eternal life. Hallelujah. Let us stand fast into the liberty wherein Christ has made us free and be not again entangled in the yoke of bondage. For God is our rock. He is our shield. And he's our hiding place. Hallelujah. Jesus. Hallelujah. Went up. Hallelujah. After he led his disciples unto Bethany. And while he opened their understanding. Hallelujah. The Bible said he was taken away. And behold, the angel of the Lord. Stand in white raiment. So ye men of Galilee, why standing, gazing up into the sky, the same Jesus which I've taken away from you shall so come in like manner as you see him going. He's coming back one day. Hallelujah. All we got to do is prepare to meet him. And he's coming. Hallelujah. He's coming. He's coming back to receive us unto himself. Saints of God, let us be strong. Let us keep on holding on. Sometimes it gets rough. Sometimes it don't seem like you can make it. But one thing I'm telling you, don't give up. Don't give up, but hold on. Hold on. Hold on. For it won't be long. Hallelujah. When we look at what is going on in the world, it can let you know that the coming of the Lord is closer than what we expect. You look at the trials of life, the trouble that are going on. In the world, he telling us to look up for our redemption. Dry it nigh. Continue, saints, to fight. Don't give up. Hold on. Hold on. The battle won't be long. Pray for me. God bless you. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Bless the Lord. Yes, hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Go ahead on Thank and get the prayer, Elma, while you're there. You, Praise Jesus. God. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank, Thank you, Lord. Precious God. Yes, Lord. Our divine Father. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus Christ, we come to you, oh God. We thank you, thank you and we magnify your name for the great thing that you have done. Lord, how you picked us up and you turned us around. You plant our feet on higher ground. And Lord, you have been good to us. Mm. Remember, Lord, every one Every request is that was made on tonight. Yes. Those that lost their loved ones. Father God, we ask you to comfort them. We ask you to strengthen them. We ask you to guide them. And to keep them. To touch them, oh God. And to deliver them. You know what they're going through, Lord. And only you can comfort them in the mighty name of Jesus. Remember the sick that have been sick in their bodies, in their mind, in their heart, in their soul. 
Hallelujah. I need help. Hallelujah. Need a deliverer. Hallelujah. 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 Need you, Lord, Hallelujah. to raise them up, to strengthen them, to deliver them from what they're going through. Lord, you are able Glory. to do it because you said there's nothing too hard for thee. Lord, we believe that you are able to do all things through thy power, through the anointing, through the manifestation and the gift of the Holy Ghost, through the anointing and power, hallelujah, that you has given, hallelujah. Lord bless in a mighty way, stir up hearts and mind, change hearts, save soul, body of building up thy kingdom. My God, my God, change mind, change heart, that it will turn and come unto thee. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Bless them, O oh God. Bless, Lord. Even those that are troubled, comfort them, Lord. Those that are down, Lord, lift them up. Those that are going through, Lord, deliver. For you are able, Lord, according to your power. Hallelujah, to heal and to deliver. Hallelujah in every condition that they might in, save and unsave. Lord, in the name of Jesus, have mercy, Lord, upon them, O oh God, and deliver them from the condition that they are in. Save their soul, save their soul, save their soul, my God, that they will stand up and give your name the glory and the honor and the praise, hallelujah. These blessings and other blessings we ask in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Yes, God bless you. Amen, praise God, hallelujah. Can we say thank God for the word? Thank God for the word. Thank God for the word. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. We thank God. Praise God for the message. Amen. And the messenger. Amen. On this evening, we're just grateful to the Lord. Amen. Praise God for Amen. His word. And you know, when I was Sel was reading. Amen. The text in St. John, and you know, there was this expectation that there was more, amen, to see, more to, you know, Philip is saying, you know, you know, Lord, show us the Father. Praise God. Mm -hmm. Amen. You know, it's kind of like us, we're looking for more than what's right in front of us. Amen. Praise God. And the Lord had to tell him, look, Philip, now he that have seen me have. Seeing the Father, praise Thank God. You, Amen. You, how, how, how many know that, you know, those that had Jesus, you have the Father. Yes. And, 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 he, and, and he went back to Isaiah 9 and 6 mm -hmm. and said, his name shall be called not only Wonderful and Counselor, but mm -hmm. the Everlasting mm -hmm. Father. Yes, yes, yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Glory to God. Yes. Hallelujah. Glory. Amen. Then he had, mm -hmm. amen, the audacity. Or then he mm -hmm. had, amen, praise God. Amen. The web of all the say, you know, in Isaiah yes. chapter 45 and 5, I am the Lord and there is none else. None. None. Like you're looking for. None. None. Oh, none. glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. We have what we need. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Amen. You know, and then, then, then Paul comes along in Colossians. He said, For in him dwelleth all the fullness of the Godhead body, and ye are complete Amen. in him, which is the head of all principality and power. Amen. It is the Lord that completes us, saints. Praise God. Amen. Ah. We need is in him. And so even when he says, for in him dwelleth the fullness of the Godhead body, that word Godhead means that which makes God God. So that makes God God dwelleth in Jesus. Amen. Praise God. 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 Praise God.
Wow. Right? Because he yes. is God. Hallelujah. Yes, so we thank God. Amen. For the message tonight. Amen. Praise God. If you got Jesus, you got everything. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Everything. Me, praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We don't, amen. I, I, I even, my mind even went back to what John, John sent two of his disciples, I believe, to inquire of Jesus about the one or should we look for another? Oh, look for God. Enough. We don't have to look for enough. Yes. Oh, Jesus. Hallelujah. And he just went, he just told them, look, go back and tell John what you see. Amen. Praise God. The works prove who I am. Oh, glory to God. Thank you, Lord. Has he worked enough in your life to prove who he is? Praise God. Jesus. Oh, oh hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let me stop. Yeah. Glory to God. Jesus. Jesus. Hallelujah. He said, he said, oh, hallelujah. Oh, glory to God. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Oh, thank he is you. so good. And we, again, we thank God. Hallelujah. Amen for that message tonight. Amen. Praise God. And let us grab hold of it. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Let us just turn it over, continue to turn it over in our hearts and in our minds. Amen. Praise the name of our God. Hallelujah. Yeah. Amen. Praise God. That God. Amen. Amen. Praise God. Jesus. Amen. And it's in him we have all. Amen. Praise God. That we need. And we're just thanking God. Amen. For that knowledge, that revelation. Amen. Praise God. And that understanding in the name of the Lord. So God bless you. Amen. This evening, we thank God. Amen. Again, for each and every one of us, of, of you that are here tonight. And amen. We especially, amen, praise God. Again, want to thank all, amen, give honor to all of our mothers. Amen. Praise God. We love you. Amen. Praise God. And I will say it capitalized. Amen. We have not forgotten you. It's on its way. <laughs> praise God. Amen. So we thank God for each and every one of you. Amen. In the name of the Lord. And we're just blessing the Lord today. Amen. Praise God just for, you know, again, I just thank God for God. Somebody said, when I think of the goodness of Jesus and all oh. that he's done, praise God, my soul, my soul. Amen. Yes. Praise God. Not, not just my mouth, praise God. Not just my tongue. Amen. But this thing emanates from my soul. Hallelujah. Hallelujah Come on, somebody. Yes, Praise Jesus. the name of our yes, God. Hallelujah. Life, Lord. We thank God. Amen. Hallelujah. When I when I just begin to reflect, amen. Praise Hallelujah. God. That, that's, that's, that's what we were hearing in Mother Billy's testimony. Praise God. She just began to reflect. Amen. Praise God. And she went deep. Praise God. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And we just thank God. Amen for what the Lord is doing. And every now and then we need to, amen, we need to rehearse that. Praise God. Amen. Yeah. Amen. That time when the Lord fills you. Yes. Y'all remember that? Praise yes. God. Y'all remember that? Oh, you forgot. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise God. Poor, poor, poor sister was trying to testify, you know, in English and she just couldn't get it out. But we, we got the message. Praise God. Yes, yes, amen. Yes. We got the witness. Praise the name of our yes, Lord. Lord. Amen. And I thank God. Amen. Even Brother Howell mentioning, amen. Praise God. Amen. Amen. That the, uh, celebrating the spiritual birthday and I, I just remember being at home and him calling me praise God and yeah. amen and, and he was just he was just a speaking and speaking and speaking you know saints I went and got my rocking chair and I said I'm gonna be here a minute <laughs> amen <laughs> praise God and I just sat in that rocking right. chair and I just listened and I yes, Lord, yes, amen Lord. praise God amen about an hour Praise God. Y'all know how you know how, how good God is. Yes, <laughs> praise yes, God. Yes. And, and, and praise God. And it's, it's not that it's not that you can't stop. You don't want to stop. You don't praise want. God. Hallelujah. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> Praise the name of our Lord. And I just thank God. Yeah. Amen. God. So just, just let your mind just reflect back up just for a few yeah. seconds and, you know, go over and give him a praise for <laughs> what he had done in that moment. Praise God. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. My God, my God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. 
Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm going to ask if Brother James will give us the benediction. Amen. Praise God. In the name of the Lord. Brother James, praise God. Jesus. Oh, thank you, Jesus. <laughs> Bless the Lord. Have yes, the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Lord, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you. Praise the Lord, everyone. Hallelujah. God is good. It's just Hallelujah. That is good. Bless you all. Thank the Lord again for a wonderful service and what we have rendered unto God. Pray that God has received. Thank you, Jesus. to Him and all. So let's go for the Lord and as we do. Uh, in Jesus' name, Lord, we're grateful for this time. Thank you for blessing us, Lord God. Thank you for the word of life. Yeah. Lord God, thank you for blessing us, Lord God. Thank you for blessing us, Lord God. Thank you for all of us, Lord. Bless us now as we go down from the Pray you would you be with us until the next appointed time. Yes. So we ask your blessings upon us all. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. 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 Praise God. Amen. God bless Amen. you all. God bless. God bless. God bless you all. Good night. God bless. Good night. 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 Good night